Welcome to StartCooking.com. I'm Kathy Maester. Tis the season for cookies, and these little treasures remind me of Rudolph. An ingredient and equipment list is at the end of this video. The big surprise is that none of the typical cookie ingredients, like flour, sugar, and eggs, are needed for this recipe. Start by preheating your oven to 325 degrees. Line a baking sheet with sides with non-stick tinfoil. If you only have regular tin foil, you have to grease the foil with Crisco or cooking spray. Put in a large bowl, 3 fourths cup of raisins, 3 fourths cup of sliced almonds, 3 fourths cup of shredded coconut, and 2 cups of crushed cornflakes. Mix everything together and then measure 3 fourths cup of sweetened condensed milk and mix that in as well. Place not quite 1 fourth cup of the mixture onto the foil lined oven tray. These cookies don't really spread or change shape when they're baking, so they don't have to be really far apart. Cut the candy cherries in half and put one half cherry on each cookie. Be sure each cookie stays squished together. You may have to pat the edges with your fingers to keep them together. Bake the cookies for 14 to 15 minutes or until they reach a light golden color. Let the cookies cool for about five minutes before removing them from the tray. They're delicious as is, but Let's add some chocolate. Put the dark chocolate chips into a small bowl and melt them in the microwave. With a butter knife, spread a thin layer of chocolate on the bottom of each cookie. Let the dark chocolate completely harden before flipping them over. To melt the white chocolate, pour about two cups of water just off the boil into a medium-sized heat-proof bowl. Put the white chocolate chips into a small baggie. Set the baggie into the bowl. In about five minutes, the chocolate will be melted. Squeeze the chocolate into a funnel shape and snip the corner of the baggie. Then squirt a decorative pattern on the top of the cookies with the melted chocolate. If any of the cherries have fallen off, use the melted chocolate as glue to reposition the cherry. The white chocolate almost looks like snow. Happy holidays! For the ingredients you'll need, raisins, sliced almonds, shredded coconut, cornflakes, sweetened condensed milk, candied cherries, semi-sweet chocolate chips, and white chocolate chips. For the equipment you'll need, a baking sheet with sides, non-stick tin foil, dry measuring cups, liquid measuring cup, mixing spoon, spatula, cutting board, paring knife, mixing bowls, small Ziploc baggie, butter knife, scissors, can opener, and a cooling rack.